Hey, what is up guys? It's your boy Jam. So today I have some Battlefield 4 that I ended up buying on the PC because my good old friend Zarir, um, I saw him post some Battlefield and I was like, you know what, dude? I really love Battlefield on the Xbox and I also bought it on the PS4. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to buy it on the PC. I'm going to buy it on the PC and I bought it and I sucked. I'm telling you right now. I bought Battlefield 4, I played with the mouse and keyboard, and I was like, dude, I am horrible. I am so horrible that I decided to plug in my Xbox remote, and I was like, all right, man, time to shit on these kids. It is time to shit on these kids, and I'm going to use a remote. I'm going to be a remote user on the PC and actually destroy these dudes. I'm like, I am going to destroy them. Um... What happened was is that I didn't destroy them and I sucked with the remote also. And I started thinking like, maybe it's not that. Maybe it's not that I'm not good at mouse and keyboard. Maybe it's not the remote. Maybe it's this uh, TCL Roku TV that's 4K that I play on that anything above 60 frames and whatever, it screen tears my TV and I can't play well so I have to do free sync on or g-sync on or off whatever it is and it makes my TV stuck at 30 frames per second so imagine playing 30 frames per second on a PC and I was like dude I, I just couldn't do it so I decided to buy a Alienware monitor and I'm playing Battlefield 4 almost at 200 frames per second the whole time and it never goes below maybe 110 120 and as you can tell by this gameplay i'm so much better and i never even had any gameplay of me playing battlefield 4 because i would look at him like jesus i got like four kills and 38 deaths and i'm like i fucking suck at this i am horrible at battlefield 4 on pc i don't even want to post it i'm just i'll honestly i was like dude i'm done i just i'm gonna just use a pc and uh record off the ps4 or xbox uh, one and just use my elgato and i was like that's it that's all i'm gonna do i'm not gonna do anything else i'm not gonna do pc games anymore it's so stressful and after getting this monitor i realized gaming is just 10 times eating 10 times easier 10 times easier with a goddamn gaming monitor and um, I was talking to my good old friend Zarir about it on Instagram, and he was talking about that the 240 hertz is a waste of time. It, you need something like 140, and that's pretty much all you need, and that's good. And I was like, yeah, I th okay, you know what? I think that's what I'm going to do. But then I ended up going for the big one, and I was like, you know what? I'm just going to buy the uh, 240 hertz, so 200 fucking frames per second, one millisecond response time or whatever. Whatever any of that means, I don't know, but I ended up getting this monitor and I think my gaming on here is so much better. It looks crisp. I like it. I'm glad that I actually ended up getting this uh, Alienware monitor and actually getting an actual gaming monitor for my PC setup. And I'm actually really stoked and I can't wait to keep playing more games. And I think the next game I'm going to play is World War 3 to see if that makes a difference when I play. Um, other than that, boys, hopefully you guys did enjoy this. I haven't been posting for a while. Been pretty busy. Hit uh, uh, something happened in my personal life that I'm trying to fix right now. Um, other than that, uh, recording is going to be put on a hold for quite some time. But I am going to be trying to upload whenever I can, when I can. Besides that, boys, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. It's a rare if you're watching, bro. We got to play sometime, bro. We got to play more, bro. Alrighty, man. All right, guys. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.